Mint blockchain is a native Ethereum layer 2 for NFT industry. They have recently announced that 12% of their total token supply will be going to a certain category as airdrop. And I'm here to show you exactly how you can position for this upcoming airdrop. Also in today's video, we're going to be looking at Strato VM. I talked about Strato VM not too long ago. If you have not seen that video, go ahead and check it out right now in the same channel. Now, Strato VM has launched a dashboard where you're going to be seeing all your points accumulated and those you'll be accumulating in the nearest future. So I'll be showing you exactly what you can do to acquire more points and increase your chances of getting this airdrop because they have categorically stated that those points will be converted into the Strato VM token. So before we get started, kindly smash the like button and share this video already with your friends and family out there. If you are here to subscribe to the channel, do so also and turn on the notification bell. Let's get started. Mint blockchain has raised $5 million and we're going to be getting a share of this $5 million. Now for you to get started, you need an invite code. As you can see on your screen, this is the invite code you're going to be using and it is going to be in the description of this video. Okay, so the next thing you're going to do is to click on go. Haven't connected your wallet already and then you click on Go. I already have the Mint blockchain RPC added to my Metamax. If you haven't, then by the time you click on go, it will prompt you to add the RPC to your Metamax. Just go ahead and do that. Otherwise, you can go to chainlist.org and add it up right there. So I'm going to sign in right now. And here we go. Mint will allocate 12% of the total Mint token supply to Mint ID stakers, green ID holders, and Mint Expedition users. Now you can have the three of these and become eligible for the mass allocation yes so what are we going to do exactly the first thing is to go ahead and buy this mint id if you want to do so the price is actually on the high side at the moment the floor price is 0 0.28 ether yes if you want to buy it you go straight to the pool and it brings you right here and asks you to connect your wallet after purchasing this you can go ahead to stake it you can see that only 5000 plus has staked out of um, 10,000 okay so so if you wish to do that then it is fine otherwise we'll just go back right here now for the green card activation we're going to come back to this but then let's go ahead and end our first mp now how are you going to end this very mp there are some tags right here which you can carry out immediately so end 2000 mp you need to carry out this very tax and what is the tax you're going to be bridging around 0.01 ether into the main blockchain network yes i'm going to show you how to do that and this quest is going to be expiring on the 14th of august so if you're seeing this video make sure you go started immediately and secure your position so i'm just going to click on go and it brings us right here where we're going to be bridging from ethereum into the main blockchain um, network this is the native bridge and it is a plus using this native bridge in fact that is the reason you're going to be getting 2000 mp Okay, we'll be making a deposit, but before we go ahead to do that, we have to switch over to Ethereum Network. We click on that, switch over. Okay, so I'm just going to type in 0 0.01. Okay, and next thing is to click on uh, send, and that is going to cost a total of 0 0.011 ETA. That includes the fee. Okay, that should be around $3 to $5, maybe. I don't know. But let's go ahead and confirm and send. Yes, just like I said, that is going to cost around uh, $4 plus as gas fee. It has increased initially. It was around $2, but it is what it is. I'll just confirm this. The transaction is going on, so you have to be patient and wait for this to submit your transaction. Here we go. Your transaction is complete. That means it's a success. I'll close this and then close this as well we'll have to switch over to the main blockchain network if at any time you want to withdraw you just click on the withdraw button there is no um time frame of withdrawal you can withdraw at any time but the only challenge is that it is going to take around seven days to land into your ethereum mainnet once again so you need to have that at the back of your mind while we join okay so that is what it is now if you check your main blockchain network you will see that you have received um, the 0.1 ETA, which is right here. You have to go back to the quest page and then go back again. You, then you will see that you have earned around 2000 MP. You can see my right here. Okay, so that is how to end this 2000 MP, which of course is going to be important for the edge of. When you scroll down further, you can also see that this has checked for you because you have just done the task and that is what it is. So the next thing you want to do 
is to mint the mainnet commemorative NFT. We go again, then mint right here. So you just mint one NFT. That's a free minting because it's zero dollar right here. Just confirm it. Mint success. Okay. And there are just 41 K plus holders. This activity also is going to end on the 15th of August. Have that at the back of your mind as well. So we go back again to the quest page. Go back here and then scroll down. Okay, you will see this is checked as well. So you have the mainnet commemorative NFT. The next thing you want to do is to create your own NFT collection. Okay, you just go here again. And here it says launch an NFT collection on Mint mainnet using tools like OmniHub, NFTs to me, OmniC, and the rest of them. So you can decide to use any of this um, platform to create this NFT. I'll just show you what um you can do create this nft for example let's check out nfts to me then connect your wallet uh metamax next and confirm okay you have to sign this message to prove ownership of this wallet go ahead and do that we are in it's a create new project so you have to select where you want to create is it edition is it drop is it a generative act so it depends on what you want to do you just go ahead to select that um i'll just do drops multiple artwork and uh, let's see what happens so you give your project a name once you type in any name here it is going to be the token symbol and then go ahead to add any nft of your choice then add description of your nft next is to add the nft picture that is added then the next thing is to click on deploy to mint so i'll just mint to see what happens so these are the various steps confirming your metamax this is also a zero dollar cost transaction and that is it successful this is what your nft page is going to look like so people can mint your nft if you want them to do all of that okay so that is it now let's go back right here and then click on go back again let's see if this actually worked okay this has not checked in for us uh, maybe it's going to take a little time so we'll go straight to the next one which is to own your own mint did domain so this is going to cost you around uh, five dollars because this is happening on uh, space id i think so we just click on go then mint your id domain yeah this is on space id then click ok now we are going to connect our wallet metamax or so rather this is asking me to connect um rabbi wallet which is also fine i'll just connect that search for your choice of domain name just enter anything i'm going to go with crypto p and this is actually free and available so i'll click on that and it's going to cost me around five dollars to mint this for one year and if you want to make it two years, it's going to cost $10 and so on and so forth. So I'll just leave it for one year, then switch over to Mint blockchain and hit the register button. I'm actually using Rabi Wallet to mint this one because that's the option it's giving me. So I'll sign and create, then confirm, register success. Okay, that is it, people. Our NFT domain name is right here and we are good to go. So go back to the quest page. Then click on back again and scroll down a little. Now this one has checked in for us and I think it's fine. The next one is to go to Intract and explore the Mint Quest over there. So we've been using Intract for other projects in the past. I know you have an account, but if you don't, there's a link in the description. Use it to sign up. Now you need to sign in um, as usual, Metamax. We have signed in, so welcome to Questing World. Log in here on a daily basis to mark your strict. And this is going to be ending you some points, which of course might be important for the Interact airdrop along the line as well. So this is the quest on uh, Mint. If you click on this, it's going to take you right here. We will see the necessary um, tax you need to carry out. These are just social tax, which you can of course carry out on your own. Then you need to mint this NFT, which is the MNGA NFT. Go ahead and mint that, and then you would have completed this quest and you claim your NFT right here, which of course is going to be checked for you on the mint quest page. Okay, just like this one has checked in already. Okay, so that is it. The last one you need to do is to hold an activated green ID. This is going to give you 200 MP. Now, this is um, going to require a code as well which of course, hopefully I'm going to be able to drop a code in the description for you to get this um, green ID. When you click on go, you will see that you need to go and activate this. Yeah, so you need to connect your wallet. You need to check wallet and you need to verify your Twitter handle. Then you need to enter an invite code. You need to bind that code 
and you'll be able to have a green ID. Now, I don't have a code currently, but I'm going to get one for you and put in the description of this video. And once that is done, this is where you're going to find yourself and you can be coming in here on a daily basis to claim um, some points or what is known as me. That is Mint Energy um, point. You can see that a lot of people have been doing this for a very long time. You can see this guy has 60 million plus of this point. Now, this is very, very massive. But then you can still meet up. It depends on you. So aside coming in here to claim on the daily, there are activities. You will see tasks right here. You can go ahead to carry out this tax and you some me points. Yeah, that is it on the Mint blockchain. And hopefully we're going to be getting rewarded from the 12% of this token that will be coming very soon to, to the various eligible participants. Yeah. So let's go straight to Strato VM. Like I said, I have a previous video on Strato VM. You can go ahead and check it out before going to perform this very new updated tax. So first thing we're going to connect our wallet, Metamax, Nest and confirm, switch over to Strato VM testnet network. And here we go. We are in. Now, the next thing you're going to do is to enter a code. You need an access code. Okay, so I have one right here. I'm just going to paste it in and you can go ahead to use it as well. It should be in the description of this video. Then next thing is to start collecting points, then sign in and you will see the previous points you have from Galaxy. This is the point I have on Galaxy so far. Now you're going to have other various kind of points, the direct invite, the indirect invite, the custom quest, and you will see your total points. And also you will see your position in the leaderboard, which of course, this is my position right now. Okay. So when you scroll down, you will see season one. And they say that participate in the Stratovian Galaxy Quest and earn massive amounts of Stratovian points. Why doing so? And Galaxy points will be translated one is to one into the Stratovian point. And the Stratovian point is equal to the edge of. Okay. So it says join our Galaxy dashboard right here so when you go straight to this link and you will see all the quests you need to carry out on galaxy you can see that mine is still very locked because i've not done this quest so every day you need to come right here and check out if there's a new quest to carry out and once you carry out this quest it's going to reflect on your dashboard which is right here it's going to show your activities from galaxy points and all of that so this is very important make sure you do it because it is equal to the edge of now this is it on strato vm very simple and straightforward make sure you invite your friends and family to take part in this free edge of activities yes thank you so much for watching i trust you got value have you smashed the like button yet if not go ahead to do so right now and remember if you are yet to subscribe do so as well and, and turn on the notification bell i will definitely see you in my next one and don't forget we are going to make it bye